Our topic for today is electrical interview questions and answer. This is good reference for master electrician, journey electrician, maintenance, and for electrical engineers. Tell me something about yourself. Sample answer. I'm James, a certified journeyman electrician with experience in commercial and residential. And I put first in my job the quality, safety, and customer satisfaction. I have more than five years of experience as electricians. I am knowledgeable in performing electrical installation, maintenance and repairs in homes and plant facilities, and also proficient in national electrical code solving problems with various electrical control and system. How do you protect yourself from electrical accidents or injuries? Sample answer. I protect myself by putting safety first. I will use proper tools for the job and protective gear to prevent accident and injury. I've heard about people on the job who lose the respect for electrical power, which is a bad idea. You are assigned a task that you don't understand. How do you proceed? Sample answer. If you find that you understand the orders, but you don't have the ability to finish the job, then you tell your supervisors that you don't have the knowledge to complete the task. You may be able to find to learn how the task must be completed, or you may be able to work with someone else who can help enough to make up for your lack of knowledge. What does a fuse or circuit breaker do? What are the difference between the two? Sample answer. Fuses and circuit breakers are designed to protect the circuit when the current flow exceeded safe levels. Fuses contain a narrow strip of metal which is designed to break when the current exceeds its rated value and interrupt the power to the circuit. Circuit breaker is designed to protect a circuit from overloading or short circuits and can be reset after bimetallic element cooled down. Describe the electrical systems you have worked on and are familiar with. Sample answer. I have spent the most time learning on commercial electrical work, but I am confident working with residential as well. What is the most advanced electrical skill you have learned so far? Sample answer. I assist one of our electrician in wiring electrical panel board in our industrial project and we wired electrical motor control, PLC or programmable logic controller connection and different types of electrical motors. How important are safety regulation and following safety guidelines to you while on the job? Sample answer. Safety and customer satisfaction is my priority. I try to follow the guidelines of the company policy and review them. Additionally, I always make sure to conduct myself in a safe manner while performing my electrical apprentice job, either in residential or commercial job site. You notice some dangerous exposed wires. What do you do? Sample answer. First, you need to inform the affected areas that you are going to turn off the circuit breaker because there is exposed electrical wiring. This will allow you to work safely without hazard of electrical shock. It is important when conducting any electrical wiring to turn off electrical circuit before you touch anything. Technical question, what is OSHA? The OSHA means Occupational Safety and Health Administrations, a large regulatory agency of the United States require employers to keep their work environment safe for workers. What is mean by IEC and NEMA? The International Electrotechnical Commission, IEC, and the National Electrical Manufacturers Associations, or NEMA, are the international and American bodies, respectively, governing the standard for design, production, and distribution of electrical, electronics, and rated technologies 
collectively referred to as electrotechnical products. Technical question. How do you change the direction of the motor? In a three-phase induction motor, reversing any two of the three wires will change the rotation direction. What does 14.2 mean? Sample answer. 14.2 means 14 gates, two insulated current carrying wires, plus bare ground. The two wires usually has a black, white, and bare ground wire. Can you draw a schematic diagram of forward and reverse motor starter? This is an example of forward reverse motor starter, and this is a control circuit. And this is the power circuit of forward reverse. Can you draw a schematic diagram of a three-way switch? We have here example of a three-way switch three -way ground wire. What is the difference between relay and contactor? The difference between relay and contactor is that a relay is used to control a circuit while a contactor can be used to control and switching a circuit. And the main purpose of magnetic contactor is used for switching electric motors that draws high electric current. Do you know how to bend AMT or electrical metallic tubing? Can you pull a cable? Do you afraid of height? Do you have any electrical construction experience? These are additional questions to be asked that should be answered yes or no. Question number one. Describe or explain a time when someone got hurt. What did you do? Sample answer. We are working on a ceiling to install some lights in one of our company projects. And accidentally, one of our co-workers got electrical shock and fell down the floor and broke his right leg. I quickly got the first aid kit and called 911 and our managers for assistance. Do you have a co-worker that always annoyed you? How do you handle it? Sample answer. Personally, if I have a co-worker that continually annoyed me, I will find some common ground or interest for us to work with, and you should stay out of arguments that would cause a negative impact on your job. And if you cannot handle the situations, address the issue to your supervisor or manager. Why do you want to join International Brotherhood of Electrical Worker Union? Sample answer, in order to have a better training and apprenticeship program, and aside from that, joining electrical union you will receive a compensation that you deserve for your work you do but also adequate health benefits to cover you and your family what are you measuring when testing a fuse sample answer if you can remove a fuse from the circuit you are measuring resistance and it is the easiest way to determine if the fuse is blown by continuity testing Another way to test a fuse is by measuring the voltage across it with a digital multimeter. This is helpful if the fuse is not able to be easily removed from the circuit. What are the types of electrical systems have you worked on the fast? I have worked on residential services that use a center top neutral, various 120 volts lighting and various plug loads. 240 volt single phase loads for water heater and electric rains and air conditioner. And for commercial electrical system, three phase 277 and 480 volts and its vac loads, 120 volt single phase lighting and convenience outlet or plug. Sample answer number two. I have worked on industrial three phase electrical services like three phase motor loads and also utility power. Note, industrial and manufacturing plants have three-phase motor loads and 120-volt single-phase lighting and convenience outlet or plug. What does PPE stands for? And can you give me an example? Answer. PPE stands for Personal Protective Equipment. It's protective clothing, helmets, goggles, and other equipments designed to protect human body from injury or infection. What would you do if you saw an employee violating a safety rule? Sample answer number one. 
When you see a coworker breaking safety procedure or otherwise acting unsafely, talk to the person in private, approach your coworker with kindness and understanding that he or she maintains a safe working practice. Number two, notify your supervisor. If your coworker refuses to listen you and still doing unsafe practices, talk with your supervisor, share the details such as offender dates, times, and incidents. Why are you interested in this job? Sample answer. I am interested in this job because I am looking for an opportunity that let me exercise my skill. I feel this position will allow me to succeed because my experience is related to the job. Can you tell me something about your previous or something about your experience? I developed extensive skills with the electrical system for the last five years and I am excellent with commercial and residential installations and repairs and also knowledgeable in analyzing and solving various electrical problems. Why are you leaving your current or previous job? Sample answer number one. My current job has been a great experience, but the growth is limited because the company is relatively small. I need to look somewhere like this company where there is opportunity to grow my career. Sample answer number two. I'm ready for the next challenge in my career. I love the people I work with and the projects that I work on. But at some point, I'm looking for a company where opportunity to grow my career. What is your preferred method of diagnosing problem? Sample answer. The way I approach first, I will ask the homeowner if it is a house. But if it is a plant, I will ask the operator and get some information and this will lead you to the problem. Try to look first the simple problem like circuit breaker trip, stop express, rather than removing the electric motor immediately. Have you ever had conflict with your superior or colleagues and how do you handle it? Sample answer. I think everyone at some point had a conflict with their superior or colleagues. I'll just try to work with them whenever possible and stay away with conflict as much as I could. What is your strength and weakness? Sample answer for what is your strength. I am a hardworking and responsible person and do my duties on time. Sample answer for what is your weakness. I do not stop working until the job is done. I should know my limitation. How important are safety regulations and following safety guidelines to you while on the job? Sample answer. Safety and customer satisfaction is my priority. I try to follow the guidelines of the company policy and review them. Additionally, I always make sure to conduct myself in a safe manner while performing my electrical installation and repair duty either in a home or a plant facilities.